It's the video that seemed to really speak to a number of commuters frustrated with the TTC and overcrowding. Last week, a woman blocked the path of the 47 Lansdowne bus for blocks after she was forced to get off due to it being at overcapacity. At the time, the TTC condemned the woman's actions, yet did not address concerns about overcrowding on the route. And this couldn't be a more timely topic as we can continue our city commute series. Now, late yesterday, the TTC released their preliminary preliminary operating budget for 2018 and in it no fare increases however no increased services for existing routes either certainly there are routes that are uh, you know that have capacity issues and we look at those routes every 6 weeks and if we have uh, if we have service to spare on another route we will certainly make an adjustment where we can relieve some uh, crowding on another route what you're looking at are the top five overcrowded routes for the TTC. The top two spots go to the 129 McCowan and the 41 Keel. Now, the 47 Lansdowne doesn't even crack the top 50. And when I talk to the TTC today, they admit they don't view it as overcrowded with 15,000 riders a day. And therefore, no service adjustments are planned for the immediate future. Based on the information, the data we collect, and we do ridership, uh, we do ridership data collection all the time. Um, we know that there there is adequate service on that route at most times of day. Rush hour is always very different, particularly on a day like uh, that day where uh, you had uh, a bit of a backup at Yorkdale, and it just it sort of created a domino effect. I know you don't like the term, but is there an overcrowding issue on the 47 Lansdowne? Based on the information we have, we don't believe there is an overcrowding issue on a consistent basis on Lansdowne. However, nonprofit advocacy group TTC Rider says now is the time where changes are not only needed for the 47 lands down, but also the funding to the TTC as a whole. I've seen it before. Riders from across the city are contact us all the time. They're fed up with overcrowded buses. The TTC has 50 regularly overcrowded routes. That's a quarter of their surface routes. There's only one way to fix it, and that's more funding for the TTC. We want City Council to increase their subsidy to $1.30 per ride. Currently, they contribute just under $1 per ride, and that's the, we're the least funded transit system in North America. The average is $2.60 per ride, so we need to do better. Now to give you an idea of some of the challenges facing some of the busiest routes, the 41 Keel uh, sits about a 22% over capacity on average. Meanwhile, that 47 Lansdowne, where that video was all about, is well below that. According to the TTC, it averaged around 20 to 30% below that special red line that the TTC draws on, which it determines of whether a route is overcrowded or not. Now, if you want to see the top 15 overcrowded routes in the city, you just go to our website, citynews.ca.